the mega CNBC TV 18 exclusive news break. What is Cyrus Mystery's side of the story? CNBC TV 18 accesses a five-page letter where Mystery makes a scathing attack on the Tata Sons board, alleges he was pushed into the position of a lame duck chairman. Tata Motors vendors are anxious for Cyrus Mystery's ouster. Hope that the strategy shared a fortnight ago will not be shelved. That's an exclusive. There will be more high-profile exits at the Tata Group in the days to come. MD and CEO of Indian Hotels Rakesh Sarna may be the first to face the axe. That's another exclusive. Well, Cyrus Mystery's sacking has gotten nothing to do with the failure of Tata Steel UK. And that, interestingly, is the word coming in from the steel magnet and the founder of Kaparo Group, Lord Swaraj Paul, in an exclusive interview with us a very short while ago uh, with the CNBC TV18 Sanjay Suri. In fact, Lord Paul said that Tata Steel UK suffered because of the bad decisions taken by the British government and not because of Cyrus Mystery. An important defense coming in for Cyrus Mystery. Listen to what he had to say in an exclusive interview. I don't think it has anything to do with Tata's UK because the options which Tata's have when they, you are losing a million pounds a day were very limited. They were waiting for the British government to do something which British government was finding it difficult to do. And what was being asked for and what was necessary it was impossible except certain things happened be like falling of the pound, which did help this industry quite a bit, not long term, but short term, certainly. So I, I think somewhere the truth will come out. These things can't remain. I can't see in Britain being affected one way or the other that anybody can do some miracle I mean, I have a lot of respect for Ratan Tata, but he can't do miracles. If there is anything one has to be drawn, that was he a, a victim of uh, Tata Steel Britain. Then, I mean, I have sympathy for uh, Cyrus Mystery because uh, he was suffering from the machinations of the British politics. I mean, it's because nobody could pay, give him a decision whether he should hang around and they will do something. because. It was not in anybody's power to deliver what was being asked. And it would have been far better to say no than to just drag on.